Hello, I'm Phoenix City Councilwoman Kate Gallego, and this is On The Go. We're here at the offices of South Phoenix Healthy Start, learning about the programs that are available for mothers and their babies. I'm pleased to be joined by Melanie Beatty, who's going to tell us a little bit about the programs that are available here today. Welcome, Melanie. Thank you. Thank you for being here at South Phoenix Healthy Start. South Phoenix Healthy Start is a program that services the southern corridor of Phoenix, Levine, South Phoenix, and Maryville areas. We provide home visiting services, we provide nursing visits, we provide domestic violence groups. We also provide doula services for residents throughout the southern corridor of Phoenix. Who is eligible for the programs? Everyone who worked, who was in those 16 zip codes in the Southern Corridor is eligible. It is a completely free program. We're sponsored by HRSA, um, a federally funded program. So everyone that is available is um, able to be a part of the program. We know that babies born in certain zip codes are at higher risk for health problems. Can you speak to that problem? and? what yeah. we can do about it. Yes, I can. So in South Phoenix, we know that women are at higher risk for health issues here in this area. Some of the reasons for that are the social issues, some social determinants to health. So if they are at lower income, they're at higher unemployment, they have less access to health care, they don't have transportation to get to doctors. All of those things play a part in the health of the woman and in the baby that makes them at higher risk for health issues. If viewers, viewers hear this today and they want to get involved or get services, what are the next steps? Um, they can get on our website, get on the Maricopa County website and look under South Phoenix Healthy Start. We have information there as well as call us at 602-304-1166. They can do referrals through um, WIC services or they can do referrals through Parents Partners Plus, which is a referral service here in South Phoenix. And if people just want to be involved in creating healthier communities, but they don't have a specific person to refer or don't need services themselves, are there opportunities? Absolutely. We have a community action network. Um, it's a coalition of about 68 different organizations in Southern Phoenix. Um, that organization this year is providing a best baby zone in South Phoenix. That zone is really looking at 10 small city blocks and looking at how we can best cha make positive change in that area. So um, they can come to our CAN meetings, which are the fourth Wednesday of every month, um, and be a part of making positive change in our community. We're excited to see the results of that Best Baby Zone program. Could you share a success story with us? Um, we have several success stories. Um, one of the, the ones that is the dearest to my heart was a woman who we were providing services for in Australia Jail. She um, gave birth while she was in jail. Um, she, we were able to help her find um, the proper foster parents for the baby. After she came out of jail, she did really well um, and was able to get her baby back. And so that's a success story that, that we're very proud of here at South Phoenix Healthy Start. Fabulous, we wanna give that, that little baby a fair chance in life. And so thank you for being there. Thank you. Is there anything else that you would like to add? You know, here in South Phoenix, we know that we have some food deserts. That means that women who are pregnant are traveling more than a mile and a half to get fresh fruits and vegetables to help th with nutrition with their babies. We know that that's a problem, and that's one of the issues that we'll be looking at in our Best Baby Zones this year. Any other advice you have for parents in our community? You know, uh, just be as healthy as possible, eat healthy. Um, we have services here that can help refer you into healthcare, um, into getting food boxes, into getting um, housing, whatever your needs might be. So use the resources around you in order to help your life to, to be healthier. Wonderful, well we're lucky to have you here. It's a great resource and we're glad to help spread the word. Thank you for being in our community. When we come back, we are gonna hear a, from a parent who's benefited from the services here today. I'm Kate Gallego, thank you. They really do help so much with the classes. Um, it's like reading or anything like nutrition, like what foods to feed them. I had so many questions. They helped me at 24 seven, I could text them, send them a message. I have a question, should I take the baby to a doctor? Is there another alternative that I could go to? Um, like a home remedy or something. And they do um, give me like good opinions, good options and stuff. So it's a, it's a really good help. Welcome to On The Go. I'm Kate Gallego. I'm here with Catherine and a very special guest, Baby Miracle. 
they're going to tell us a little bit about the program and what it's been like to be part of South Phoenix Healthy Start. So um, I initially found out about the program while I was at the WIC office and um, I was still able to use my WIC um, services and I was able to meet with some of the staff of the Healthy program here. So I met with them. They told me about the services that they offer uh, as far as doulas. I was able to uh, use and connect with the services. They're very supportive during my um, pregnancy. Um, they told me what to expect and uh, I was able to attend some uh, childbirth classes, um, encapsulate my placenta. <laughs> <laughs> she looks like she wants you. <laughs> and um, keep my umbilical cord. They told me about the skin-to-skin -skin contact, and um, they provided resources for me. Um, my case manager did um, resources for the baby, um, baby products. I was able to um, use the transportation services and see a nurse here, um, follow up for her and, and the baby well child check. Um, my case manager here, her name is Myrna, and she keeps me up to date with uh, community resources and things like that. Um, I've obtained food box services. Um, she keeps me posted, or she's a great resource for um, anything regarding housing or any extra com community services that I may, may need or inquire about. It sounds like Miracle is a big fan of the case manager as well. So good to to get to hear from you both. So this program is available for experienced mothers in addition to first time mothers. Yes. So um, even though <laughs> Miracle is number five for me, um, it does, it takes a village and so the support is great. Here, do you wanna, do you wanna get, get some help from your village? <laughs> So it was very helpful to me um, that they did support me with being a new mother and, and just like emotional support. Also, um, things like Zumba and, and self-care kind of options also. Um, it was very convenient um, on the weekends, on Saturdays. So, you know, it did also work with work. Wonderful. Yeah. And you're a mother of five. I Yes, <laughs> I'm a mother of five, so... They don't come with an instruction, um, you know, manual, but it's it's definitely great to have the support. It makes a big difference. We all definitely need, it's a huge blessing, but it's also wonderful to have support to make this wonderful opportunity a little bit easier. Absolutely. <laughs> and so would you recommend the program to both new mothers, first time would, mothers? And definitely, yes. I would, I would recommend the program to uh, new mothers, young mothers, um, or even experienced mothers because I have, uh, I've learned a lot about myself um, being a new mom or a mom of um, different age groups of children and um, I'm constantly learning. Wonderful, and there's new information all the time. So yes. I've talked to people who had babies 10 years ago and now there's best practices that are different since someone had the first baby. That's true. So. Um, yeah, I've learned a lot about new services, um, classes that are offered. Um, my case manager, uh, Myrna, she does also keep me up to date with community events and, and certain services that are available to me as well. So not only the services that they offer here. Fabulous. Well, thank you so much for sharing your story with us and introducing us to Beautiful Miracle. It was nice meeting you. Good meeting you as well. This has been On The Go with Kate Gallego. As always, if we can be of help, please contact us at the City Council office. Thank you.